Okay, this is weird. In the last 90 days, over a thousand people have watched one of my YouTube videos because ChatGPT told them to. I didn't plan for this. I didn't ask for it. I didn't buy ads or anything like that. So today I'm gonna do something that might be a little crazy. I'm gonna just ask ChatGPT, how do I get my videos recommended by you? And then I'm gonna start doing whatever it says. And if this works, it could become the newest YouTube growth hack you've never heard of. At least until everybody else figures it out. And this all started when I was looking at the analytics on one of my videos to see where the traffic was coming from. And when I look under external, you can actually see the third one after Google and YouTube is OpenAI ChatGPT. And it's not just one or two views, it's actually gotten over a thousand views in the last 90 days. And I was curious, like how long has this been going on? So I dug a little deeper and I got my first recommendation from ChatGPT May 28th, 2024. So a while ago, right? But you can see in the last couple of months, it has been picking up a lot. Now, a few years ago, I might've thought, well, that's interesting. But now I can just ask ChatGPT, hey, why are you recommending my videos? So let's see what happens. We'll start by saying I've noticed that you sometimes recommend a YouTube video when you answer a question. How do you decide what videos to recommend? Let's see what it says. So I paused recording so I could read through that. And there was some stuff that I expected it to say and some stuff that I didn't. So first, it says I recommend a video if it helps explain, demonstrate. That's a key thing. I always tell people, hey, YouTube is where people are still going to look for answers that chat GPT can't give them like in text, right? It also said from trusted sources, which makes me think it's more likely to recommend from a channel that has a bigger following or at least has been around for a while. Now, I thought this was interesting. I aim for videos that are not too long unless necessary. Now, that video I showed you a second ago where I noticed it was getting traffic from ChatGPT was a shorter one. It was less than five minutes, I think. And then here, especially for tech topics, I try to pick newer videos so the content isn't outdated. That's kind of cool. That means they are recommending newer videos. All right, let's try this. How do you decide whether to recommend a video or just give a text answer? Couple of interesting things in this response. First of all, if the answer is straightforward and text can fully explain it, then why am I gonna bother you sending a video, right? But again, we see visual or hands-on, or again, seeing diagrams or demonstrations. But there's one more piece in this answer that I think is interesting user preference. Basically, it's saying that if somebody likes videos, or let's say it starts recommending videos, and you click on it over and over again in your ChatGPT account, it's probably going to recommend more videos for you in the future. But if you never do, then it may stop recommending videos to you. Next, I want to ask this question. Do you think other AI tools recommend videos the same way? Because what we're seeing is that Google and so many other places when people used to go and search for answers is being replaced by AI tools. So I'm just curious if it thinks this will also apply to Google Gemini and Claude and all of the other AI tools that are out there. A couple of interesting things in the answer here. Google Gemini more likely to recommend videos because Google owns YouTube. So that's not surprising. But it says Perplexity AI as well as Claude and some others tend to be more conservative, not suggesting videos unless explicitly asked. And then claims that ChatGPT is context-driven. I'm like, me is context-driven. I recommended videos only if it clearly makes the answer easier to understand. Just like we saw in the previous answer. So this feels like it's a little biased, like ChatGPT is like, I do it the best, but it does sound like the best chances of us getting recommended on YouTube are going to be through ChatGPT or Google Gemini. Let's try this. There's many ways to optimize a YouTube video, title, description, keywords, etc. Please generate a list of what you look at when deciding to recommend a video from YouTube ranked from most important to least important. I'm going to add one more thing. Include every single thing that can be factored into your decision. So the answer it gave me feels more like a generic best practices kind of thing. So I'm going to ask it to be clear, I'm asking for the exact factors ChatGPT uses when recommending videos, not YouTube, Google, or overall best practices. All right, important parts in here. The video must address exactly what you ask, not loosely related topics. That makes sense. So this looks like more of best practices. I did notice here videos with timestamps, chapters, or a structured flow are slightly favored. And when we get down here, it looks like it's primarily based on the same metadata that YouTube uses, title, description, upload date, because they talked about recency, and the source channel name. Notice it does say, I do not use engagement metrics like likes, views, or comments as my primary signal. Those are secondary at best unless you specifically ask for most popular videos. 
So my decision system is relevance, trustworthiness, clarity, recency, reasonable length, no deception, basic quality. Everything else like SEO, tags, or even popularity is either minor or ignored unless you request it specifically. So again, SEO and tags are not part of it. All right, based on that and my experience on YouTube, how are we going to take that information and actually figure out how to make videos that ChatGPT will recommend? Here's the process that we're going to follow. All right, I'm back in here. I did a temporary chat here because I don't want to include any of our previous conversation with ChatGPT or any of my own ChatGPT history in this. But I'm going to say, I want to make a YouTube video that will be recommended by ChatGPT as a helpful answer for people. The video is about getting ChatGPT to recommend YouTube videos, which I realize is a little meta. Please generate a title, topic, description, and tags for a video on this topic. So now it's gone through and it's given me an exact title, topic, description, and tags that I should use with my YouTube video. So now that I have this knowledge, I'm realizing there is a formula right in front of us. We just have to ask. So will this actually work? Well, full transparency, this is the first video that I am applying it to. In fact, I did go with a different title, but other than that, I used everything ChatGPT recommended. So try it yourself, ask ChatGPT for title, description, tags, maybe even thumbnail ideas for your upcoming YouTube videos and see what happens. And if you wanna stay ahead of these shifts, I'm certainly gonna be tracking it. I'll be sharing it here on the channel. So make sure to hit subscribe, click that notification bell so you are aware when we release another video all about this. All right. Thank you so much for watching Done by Lunch Entrepreneurs. I'll see you in the next video.